one chance, got one job. Go to KaplanCycles.com forward slash raffle, and you could win the Kaplan America CR500. Ripper. What did you do to it? Gave it the wizard tune. Cob work was a secret. The 2021 YZ450F put down 52.35, which is the same as a motocross action dirt bike, their dyno run that's online also. So you've got four more horsepower and 20% more torque on the two stroke. So um, that's basically the proofs in the pudding. said when we rode it down at the museum on the tar it is absolutely one of the fastest 500s i've ever ridden tom morgan knocked it out of the park on this one let's bring it up to the field hop on First time I rode that, uh, first time it's been ridden off-road is an absolute rocket ship. It feels extremely stable, even at fifth gear tap, a sign of a well-balanced chassis. The motor's off the hook, third gear starts no problem. Like I like to say, if you don't win, it ain't the bike's fault, that's for sure. Like my dad used to say, if you ain't happy right now, you'll never be happy. It's as good as it gets. Very vibration-free compared to some of the 500s I've ridden. Um, it's a well-balanced motor. Tom Morgan, hats off, brother. Great job, AJ. It doesn't get any better than what you're doing. Keep up the good work, and God bless America. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the hallowed grounds of the Kaplan Compound, home of the 500 shootout. And I might ask, mirror, mirror on the wall, is this the fairest 500 of them all? For the first time ever, we've got RM Zilla, a brand new 2021 CR500 AF, just built by the godfather of the 500s, AJ Wagner, built500.com. We've got the 97 Steely, we've got the David Bailey replica, and we have the 03 AFX. Now, you gotta admit, looking at this thing, this has gotta be the most badass looking 500 I've ever seen. Chrissy Steiger really knocked the graphics out of the park on this one. And the best in the industry worked on this. The best, the best 500 guy, hands down, AJ Wagoner, built500.com, built this chassis uh, for this 500 motor. The motor was sent to Tom Morgan, where it had a no expense build, full custom build, starting at the intake. It's got a brand new twin air filter. Of course, this bike is brand new. It was all built out of NOS parts. The um, carburetor is a brand new PWK Air Striker carburetor with a stick mod the super torque stick mod it has a if you zoom in v-force moto tassinari reed valve this has the kips kawasaki power valve system you can see that tom morgan put on a decompression lever so you can start this in your sneakers like a 125 it, the cylinder has been ported polished everything's brand new and aj actually had this pipe made this is a one-off pipe by a company called van Husen that did this for aj in the frame um, no expense spared build on this bike the suspension's brand new, everything's brand new. This is the first time this bike has touched the ground here. Uh, we've ridden it three heat cycles and broke it in up at the museum riding around the parking lot there on the tar, uh, but it hasn't been off-road yet. This will be the first time. If you look closely, you can see it's got the service Kawasaki from AJ Wagoner, service Honda, service Kawasaki hoses. It's got the service Kawasaki custom built handmade radiators the radiator uh louvers aj shipping them to us they uh we just completed the bike but we didn't put the radiator louvers on those are coming this week just take a look pro taper bars pro grip eight and one grips asv quick adjust levers um 
the fat bars. It's got a guts seat with a thick seat foam, full custom graphic package. It has in a service uh, chain guide. It's got the green hammerhead adjusters. It's got the Pro X sprocket and gold chain. The best of everything, folks. Billet aluminum, hand, uh, a billet aluminum machined Tom Morgan Racing ignition cover. This is pretty much unobtainium stuff. That's it's not in stock. It has to be ordered. Um, uh, Tom Morgan's got a long back order right now. Uh, custom handmade or uh, billet aluminum chain guide. It's got the hammerhead shifter. Just just a stunning piece, guys. Everywhere you look, trickery. And this is, as far as being the fairest of them all, I can tell you this is the most exclusive 500 conversion. Less of these have been done than, uh, the, obviously, the Honda was number one. And it's probably a toss-up between this and the RMZilla. But the guys that love the Kawasaki's love these. It looks badass with, with the red, black, and green Monster Energy livery on it with the matching seat, all designed by Christy Steiger. Of course, it's got the Kaplan America flair with the American flags on there. Junior, is there anything you'd like to add on this? I know you were a Kawasaki guy for a while there. Yeah, it's a brand new build. It's never been ridden. So we're going to demo it for you guys today. And talk about the dyno numbers. Oh, yeah. I, I almost forgot. This bike is a record holder for a motocross 500 on our dyno. It has the most horsepower of a motorcycle, uh, of a, of a um, hill climb 500 we've had on the dyno. Not by a lot. It was like a half a horsepower more than the Millar Race Engineering CR500. Could be the power valve, could be the exhaust. I don't know. But this one is on the top step of the podium for motocross. Second only to the Packard Enterprises huge electron car, giant CPI pipe hill climb monster that we ran. Uh, now that, that bike's set up more for wide open desert racing. This is set up, you can ride this in the woods, you could ride this motocross, you could ride it um, pretty much anywhere. It, this has power everywhere. That's the beauty of the Kips power valve system that you have power down low. I was riding the dri around the driveway, just cracked the throttle, brrr, stands right up. Just a fantastic piece. Uh, there are none others for sale today, guys. Uh, you can order one from AJ. Um, give them a call, see what the turnaround time is. Uh, it's the end of the riding season now. It's August, at least in New England. We got another two months uh, to late October. This one's brand new and ready to go. No excuses. It's got the best of everything. Tom Morgan really knocked it out of the park on this motor right here. And um, it's brand new and ready to go. If you have any questions, give us a call at 860-454-7024. Study the pictures close. Um, you can see the Shawa SFF forks. These are the best. One of the best production set of forks has a green anodizing on the top here. Uh, black has a DLC coated lower. Black DLC coated lowers along with the black rims. Just pure sex appeal. The one I said is the fairest of, of them all. You got to admit, this is one badass looking, badass running rocket ship of a 500. And it's got the one of the best production suspension packages out of the box. So basically, get on it, put the compression, kick the compression release in, start it and line it up at, at your motocross track or wherever you want to ride it it's ready to go good luck god bless america